I know what you're thinking, punk. Question is, can I get Wolverine before he turns me into shish kebab with those claws? Bum bum. Seeing as how these claws are adamantium, the strongest metal known, and can slice through vanadium steel like a hot knife through butter, buddy. You gotta ask yourself, do I feel lucky? Hello, everyone. Thanks so much for joining me here today as we get to talk about one of my favorite subjects, comic books. My name is Jose. I love comic books. I love talking about them. I love sharing them with you. Feel free to follow me on social media if you would like. Links are in the description below. I've also posted a link to the Marvel fan site that I have plot synopsis and character bios for this issue. We're going to be looking at Deadpool Wolverine World War Three, done kind of here with the uh, claws. Uh, written by Joe Kelly and art by Adam Kubert. I love me some Adam Kubert. I wish he would draw more. He's also busy with his own school, his father's school. Rest in peace, Joe Kubert. So if you can get Adam to pretty much get you three to four issues a year, you're golden. If you can get six, it's like, wow. Um, dude just isn't very fast to begin with, and then the school really probably takes... A lot of time this is um uh the uh normal cover but we've also got the variant cover here i think this is gabriel delotto and um here's a second variant done with this modern uh computer um coloring type you know where it looks you know it's all probably done digital so um, Lee in Uh, Rob Liefeld here. Rob Liefeld, I don't mind him very much when he's just doing a cover. I think he's good for covers, but man, uh, do I, <laughs> I'm not a big fan of his insides. Don't know who this dude is. So, um, <laughs> a humorous one here. And then Mike Zek, legendary Mike Zek here. So, uh, starts out with a memoriam with uh, for or sorry for Paul Neri. I just uh, covered half of his Captain America run. So, Adam Kubert draws with a lot of double page spreads. Um, sometimes I feel that this is done for him to be able to work faster. Which sort of cheats the the reader. Comic books are expensive, and and when you've got double page spreads of just a guy walking into the woods, um, yes, we see here that there is a um, something here, but um, it, it just it it seems wasteful. This could have been done in half a page, but um, like I said, the dude's not very fast, so we do what we do. So, um. We got two guys walking into the field, most likely in Canada. Uh, this is Wolverine. This appears to be like a sun. And then there's a creature um, hurling toward him. And you can see him grab the kid and he's got his axe there. That creature is um, the Weapon X thing, but look how monstrous it is. And so... Um, the Wolverine here holds the kid very closely and um, slashes at him. And uh, he's still trying to protect the kid. You can see how monstrous it's turning. And it turns out it was a dream. That's how we start. And Wolverine is uh, about to land in a Vancouver. So, of course, we then get the credits here. Joe Kelly is the writer. Adam Kubert is the artist. Uh, I'm going to do mostly narration for this video as opposed to reading it. Um, I'm not a big fan of Deadpool. I It just it just doesn't work for me. And a lot of his uh, dialogue is silly. And so... So we've got Vancouver here. Um, again, some of the stuff that I don't like about digital... Um, or, or arty, artists, depending on digital, is they don't render very much and they let the colorist. So, you know, this is essentially somebody else just drawing. Adam Kubert 
probably just did this. And even then, I don't know how much of that he would have done. So, um, and so Wolverine starts by talking to us. He says he has a phone. It's a flip phone. And he picked it up because um, he says when the phone rings here, and you can see him going from jumping to jumping. When the phone rings, it means someone's hurt bad or someone needs hurting bad. And so... Um, and so he was called by the Vancouver PD inspector that he used to run in back in the day. Um, Wolverine says she's a good person. She goes by the book and says even good cops got a limit. So she called Wolverine because there's a uh, killing of an undefinable variety and undefinable is code word for powers. And so he says, why'd they, uh, why not call Alpha Flight? And they figure it's because Wolverine will do what needs to be done. And so Wolverine smells something. And so he cracks his neck here. And he's preparing. And then he looks on. And suddenly there is an explosion. And he takes out his claws there. You can see the snicked. And of course... It's Deadpool here. I love the happy birthday make a wish. And this is what I mean about Deadpool and the stupid dialogue. I understand it's it's be I just it just doesn't work for me. It's fine. Um if you're a big Deadpool mark, hey, good on ya. I am not. So and this is someone here who apparently has some reality warping type powers it's also very confusing um and wolverine effing deadpool crap and i'm not gonna symbolize the cursing because i don't want this to become an adults only video and so here comes deadpool falling down you can see his sword is breaking this guy's also falling he talks in riddles it's very confusing because we have both him and deadpool doing uh, very weird um, the way they talk you see this energy thing around him uh, like I said it seems to be some kind of reality altering thing Wolverine hits him from behind with his um, with his claws here and Deadpool warns him look out for those energy things he just says which of course end up hitting Wolverine so after being hit with Wolverine's claws, he's he's okay still. And so Wolverine's going to go at him and Deadpool just shoots. Doesn't seem to hit Wolverine, um, although he does go, Hur! so it must have. But you can see that it, it uh, Deadpool aims it so it doesn't hit Wolverine here. And um, you can see that the knives that were thrown don't seem to hit. He does, however, hit Wolverine, and um, Deadpool is like, hey, you look good, and uh, Wolverine kind of starts, um, so this guy disappears, sorry, and uh, Deadpool says, it looks like we're going to have a team up, to which Wolverine just says, piss off, Wade, so... So Wolverine's going after that guy, but Deadpool shoots him in the leg because there's a bounty on it. And of course, Deadpool wants to be the one. This guy's having issues. He doesn't know what's real, what's not. So he just keeps saying you aren't real. So um, I love the art. I really, really, really do, which is why I'm covering it. It's not just about the good stories. I do plenty of good stories that don't have good art. So we're going to do a story with good art, hopefully just with me narrating it versus reading it. It's a little bit more tolerable. So Wolverine's still kind of just growling here. And so Deadpool, of course, does some com comedic thing based on the growl because, hey, that's what uh, we do. And so... And so this is what I mean... Um, Wolverine's like, I got an idea. Fantastic. Hit me. And then he's like, ah, that's it. Thanks for the cover. And so that that is essentially what Wolverine did. Uh, Deadpool also has a healing factor. So Wolverine's like, stay out of my way. And this guy's like, you're different. You're real. And he asks for help. 
and um, grabs Wolverine with his um, whatever with that energy beam of his. And so Deadpool uh, shoots at it. Look at him just on Wolverine here. Um, Deadpool, of course, talks a lot. And Wolverine just says, shut up. And uh, this guy is, they promised me the gifts would help me connect, but. And then all of a sudden you can see uh, some kind of uh, shooting, I would imagine, or at least. And then he goes again, Summer. And Deadpool's like the bounty, and Wolverine's like civilians. And uh, Deadpool, the bounty of endangered civilians. So, all right. And so he's falling the energy beam here. You can see it behind them. The people, of course, are like, crap. And here are Wolverine and Deadpool. Wolverine's saying, um,. Hunter, hunter, you know, hunters know a monster is just a wounded animal, the most dangerous kind. Only one fix to that. So we got the claws and we got the um, uh, katana blades. And so you can see Deadpool is cutting and Wolverine is cutting. Um, and so this guy is like, I use your gifts. Um, were you watching these wasted gifts? I used them, but I wasn't real either. So, and then the guy cut up into ribbons as well. And um, Deadpool makes a joke to which Wolverine just says, F you, Wade. So, all right. And so we get uh, uh, some time later here. Deadpool tells Wolverine, hey, let's go have some drinks. Deadpool, or Wolverine tells him, just go count your money. So um, Wolverine, I guess, wanted to save the dude um, as opposed to killing him. But which strikes me as odd because I, it seemed like he would have killed him. Wolverine has never been one character that really has a problem with killing. Now, he has found different ways to try not kill, but sometimes he, he just knows that there's no choice to which uh deadpool sounding um as the um as the intelligent one says you weren't gonna save a guy like that sometimes broken is just broken same thing could be said about us um it's that's very true um so uh and then he corrects himself me not you not anymore so so, Wolverine, um, sorry, Deadpool goes ahead and takes off. I love it. Jumps, just jumps off the building here. Um, so from here, um, so, all right. So, even later, then this bartender's uh, sending Wolverine some liquor. He says thanks. Just keep him coming. Um, Wolverine, of course, had a very hard day love the art i really i really do like adam kubert here so um wolverine really had a very hard day so um so he asked for us uh is there a slim norton's around here i don't know what that is so um are you kidding me right pick a direction and start walking you'll hit one every 10 feet or so and then he's like tourists so now we got wolverine breaking into this um room here um you can see the snow there's garbage piling up here um wolverine's still thinking about the guy that um he killed here i love that canada eh so and um he sniffs here um Puts his hand in, in this uh, cooler or garbage, maybe. And there is a phone there. And Wolverine effing Deadpool. So now we're in Russia. A uh, tech head pal, Forge, uh, traced the burner's phone call uh, to Siberia. So 
He's now looking for Deadpool in Siberia. And so he uh, breaks in and look at this. Who would want to be in Siberia, really? But um, Deadpool is a bit uh, crazy. So, um, so Wolverine is looking around. I told you it's easier if I narrate because it's just... Um, weird and so these guys all come in you can see here no witnesses Wolverine pops his claws this is such a cool pose I mean Adam Kubert is really good again my biggest scrap on Kubert is that he doesn't draw enough it's just uh, but man is he good he is really good um, when he went to DC to do Superman, I, I, the dude got like eight issues. I think in the two year contract that he had at DC or three year contract, um, he did like, um, a total of 12 issues. I mean, of things, I mean, he did like, um, seven issues of, of Superman on action comics. And then he got, like a couple of issues here and there of other stuff, but this dude is just not very fast. It is so unfortunate. Um, so uh, Wolverine says enhanced humans smell like the killer we put down in Vancouver. So, um, and Wolverine realizes this is not a capture mission. They're trying to kill him. So, and Wolverine is, look at this. This is so cool here. Wolverine is going to deal with them the way he deals with things. And so, sorry, I meant to um, look at that. All right, now we'll go to the next one here. And so, look at this. Have you ever been to the Boshoi, Mr. Logan, he says. Club-footed miscreants compared to you. Your performance exceeds the expectations. He, and he goes, performance what else does one call art in motion? And he says, "Oh, the film are you, uh, the films are one thing, but to see you work in person, why? What game is Deadpool playing? The answers are here, sir." And then, um, Wolverine, I believe he slashes at him. Um, he's trying to give him the envelope here, and he says, "Thanks." So. And so Wolverine is, I look at him eating the donut here, um, heading toward this compound here. And this lady's like, welcome to Colabel, Mr. Logan. And Spasivo, darling, might want to take that ride back to civilization and look for a new gig. You're about to be unemployed. And she's like, Heh, thank you, sir. So... And so when he gets there, he, there's the lights, and uh, look at this, everybody's clapping, and he finally arrives, the one and only, the Wolverine, and they're like, welcome, sir, and he's like, where's Deadpool, and um, this lady's like, the voice, I have chills, so um, everyone's very happy to see him, and this guy's like, he's shorter than I thought, and of course, Wolverine is supposed to be um short and so as he's walking here he opens that uh curtain he's like holy crap and there's this dude and he says wade as in deadpool and look at this here and so they look And so we see another double page spread, but this one's actually pretty freaking cool. Look at this. Um, and so the the new Deadpool, apparently, or the Deadpool that's under, look at this, just slashes on Wolverine here. That's a pretty cool image. And so here they all clap here, and uh, the, the person here says, Third time's the charm were his last words before he was sedated. Perhaps you can explain the reference here, if you can spare the breath here. So, and um, you can see if his fault. You followed him for a reason. Were you friends, rivals? Either way, no one truly knows what another is capable of when faced with the opportunity to transcend and Wolverine is like um you've got 
you're one. I can't give give you another shot. Now, the time to speak up before I start cutting. And then they pause. I'm going to kill you. And uh, here everybody just claps, claps, claps. And um, here we go. Um, becoming number 205A begins now. Observe, friends. Um, the power of change. And so, look at this. To be continued. So, this actually ends issue number one. Very cool. Um, splash page. When you count the double page spreads and the splash page, um, there were a lot of shortcuts taken to try to finish this. But um, we did get all three issues uh, monthly here. So, and so here we go with number two. Um, here's the standard cover by Qbert. And we've got Wolverine and Deadpool here. Um, but then we've got a shadow cast on the ice. And then a Salvador La Roca, who I put just a notch above. Um, Oh my God, he's also a Photoshopper, um, Greg Land, because at least Salvador um, still kind of draws and knows, but Greg Land is just a Photoshop um, swipe artist, and so is La Roca, but um, I guess let's just say there's degrees to this, and I'll take La Roca over Greg Land. And then uh, this was the third cover. Um, don't know if this was for some kind of, uh, thing Marvel was doing. I don't know. I don't really get too many, um, uh, new comics. So another, another memoriam here, this guy, um, I guess he was, uh, he died at the age of 50 from lupus. So I have seen some of these, uh, covers before very, very cool. Um, very, uh, like, Native American. Um, oh, then there it is. The Museum of Native American. So, look at that. Hulk. That's cool. And Iron Man. All right. So, we start off with, uh, similar to page one, with another double page spread that um, really could have been done in one page. But... Uh, Again, we just we just have to take this is this is modern comic books and me screaming like an old man to the sky saying, you know, this isn't it. You know, what do I know? But this is modern comic book storytelling. And uh, why do anything in one page when you can do it in two? <laughs> I guess so. Um, here you see a guy kind of like in a suit that's going to receive some stuff and um him and this doctor i don't know whether or scientists i don't know if they're in a relationship or not so i just um don't know so so it looks like they're trying to create a super soldier serum again here and so um he's looking though at his uh thing here saying hey there's something wrong but this guy is kind of being vain because he feels strong. You can see him attack the guy that gave him the powers here. And so we get here. The subject is in the arena, sir. Yes, the becoming has begun. So the way I would explain these three issues here is this is an action movie. Okay. The whole point of this is really... To just let Adam Kubert shine. It's re it, this is really um, an action movie. It's really not a big plot. The words are there to make you slow down as you're um, as you're reading it because um, you know otherwise you would look at this in <laughs> you know less than a minute. So, um, but there's just not much to story. This is this is all a freaking um 
action movie. So here we get our credits again. We get another, another double page spread, but these spreads I don't mind so much because it's really a splash page on one side, which is uh, fine, and then the other side then with the panels here. So we've got Deadpool, or the new Deadpool, the, the converted Deadpool into whatever... Uh, fighting Wolverine. So then we got all these things that are kind of filming um, the the thing here. So and Wolverine's trying to get um, Deadpool to snap out of it here, and uh, he takes out his arm. <laughs> but he goes, Shh, "I prefer the quiet." Which, of course, is so anti-Deadpool, as you can see him growing another arm. And so this group of people is watching them fight as if this was a movie of some kind here. And, uh, and they ask here, do you think the Wolverine can upset the experiment? And then the guy, the guy goes, if he does, I'm going to withhold my um, my funds. And so... This guy's here like idiots. Um, and then he calls for this girl named Greta. And he says, prepare yourself. This be this becoming requires a new set of parameters. And she's like, mm-hmm. So, um, Adam Kubert, and th you're going to hear me throughout this video do this a lot, but I really... I really like him. I really, 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 really like him. I like him even more than his brother, Andy, who I think is superb. And that's how much I I really like Adam. But he just... Oh, if he was just faster. So... And so we got uh, Deadpool ready to strike at Wolverine, which he does. And look at Wolverine. Screw this! And um, slashes at Deadpool. And he's like, you're losing sympathy points, Wade. I've been there. Brain full of probes. Out of my damn mind. Only thing ever shook me out of it. And so here we go. And we get yet another double page spread here. And Wolverine says, pain. And so... Bam, he claws him, and he's like, have you had enough? And the Deadpool says, yes, but still in that uh, voice thing. And you can see he now attacks Wolverine with his um, whatever energy things. And so he says, there is something I want. You are in my way. Destroy what's in my way, and I get what I want. Simplicity. And then this... Uh, um, forgot her name, Greta. So she says something here. She also has um, powers, it looks like it. And so um, there's a big smile right above or right behind them there. And you can see the smile is going to get really big here. And so she closes them and kind of eats them um, and then spits them out here. And so um, Wolverine, of course, hits this thing and shatters his uh, spinal cord, which I thought, you know, of course, he says death for a regular chump. Here's the thing. It's not supposed to break. I don't care how hard they hit it. It's, it's made out of adamantium. Why does it break? It, 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 these are kind of the things that, you know, Chris Claremont spent 12 years, no, 16 years saying you know um wolverine's bones don't break and you know so it shouldn't shatter but that's all right um and uh here's deadpool look at him over here <laughs> so um here mr logan would you be so kind as to stop impaling my patient someone says off panel He's still in recovery. Before you attempt to eviscerate me, I would like to explain your predicament and your options. Call me Delta. So, how about American Airlines? Yeah, it's unfunny. Is this something Deadpool would say? 
So, all right, and here you can see the mouth right behind him. Um, so, Wolverine says, "What'd you do? Uh, what'd you do to him?" And he said, "His becoming, which is exactly what he asked for, to become the his the best he can." So. He says his uh, self-destructive ego, um, you know, they remove that self-destructive ego that derails him. And now his potential for greatness is exceptional after he has adjusted to his new life. And Wolverine's like, what did you do? And so uh, this guy here uh, continues here. And he says, I would love to explain bleeding edge bio biomechanics to an uneducated dullard. And Wolverine says, try me. And he sighs here. I forget how tiring self-proclaimed uh, proclaimed heroes can be. So Wolverine notices the earpiece and that assumes that he's putting on a, uh, a show for whoever is watching. So he basically says what he did to Deadpool is done. So what's done is done. And um, he's going to offer a becoming of his own. And Wolverine says, you're not offering nothing. It's the other people with the masks. And Greta's like, ha, he's got your number. And so he says, Wolverine's only at his best when he's at, at his worst. And Wolverine says, ha, huh, that's a theory. And he says, one that we shall test. And he throws Deadpool. And Greta opens her mouth. And um, it's uh, they're about to get swallowed here. And... Deadpool's like, Logan, where did you come? And so, um, now he takes Wade here and he's like, effing Deadpool. So Wolverine guesses that this person is a teleporter here and, um, recognizes the, uh, Siberian tundra and they are, could be a thousand miles from where they, um, had started here. And so Wolverine's like, I'm going to wire your teleporting jaw shut, Greta. So Wolverine says, ready to move, need some height. Let's see if we can spot a village. And so Deadpool's, of course, trying to uh, warm himself here. And Wolverine says, you don't sound like yourself. Typically, that would thrill me, but you're not trying, you're not fixed. So, but if you're not fixing to make more trouble, he goes, no, no, I wanted to kill you, but I got over it. We, sh we should part ways for both our sakes, he says here. And so Wolverine says, I like, um, I like this, how, um, I like this panel as opposed to just being like, just a face or whatever, just showing the two of them there. Uh, I'm here because I wanted, uh, you wanted me to follow you. And uh, Deadpool says, yes, I'm sorry about that. I, he was frightened, I guess. I'm not frightened anymore. I'm not him anymore. Third time's the charm. And so they're still being watched here. And so. And so this dude says, watching even two exceptional specimens fighting is like most of human civilization and nastish. A nasty, sorry, nasty, brutish, and short event. Sometimes meaningful change requires endurance. And so these guys are like, you heard them, folks. We need exotic meats and a lot more booze. It's going to be a marathon event. And the other one says, if we're not entertained, um, sorry, and if we're not entertained, question, that last event engineered by our esteemed Mr. Delta. And so I really like this panel. This is one page, and look at all the panels that uh, this isn't a double page spread. This is just um, Adam Kubert fitting. So he goes from doing these elab or these double page spreads to shorten time, and then he goes and does these um, pages um, here. So it's at six twelve. 18 oh my gosh 24 panels here so goodness gracious so all right so 
now so we we uh we get here that it's been a few days um and Deadpool barely has talked at all and so Wolverine still sees that he's uh being watched so now it's a week and uh they got water that they can drink they don't really have much that they can eat here and so um so now here it's been two weeks and now three weeks so they just keep watching here um suddenly here we see deadpool start to cough here um now we're in four weeks and so now we're in six weeks suddenly um the wade wilson is the 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 deadpool that we know just starts to make little cracks here and there so wolverine's wondering if um that's the the stuff you know the change here and so so they haven't run into any game and he thinks that maybe that's perhaps delta's doing as they continue to watch and now it's been seven weeks so we got another double page spread here and deadpool wolverine doesn't think deadpool's gonna make it here uh they seem to have gotten something here uh, a rabbit or a raccoon um but it's actually a piece of wolverine's meat if you can see right here um he's trying to keep deadpool alive <laughs> so <laughs> ouch and so um he's he's still kind of not talking but he says well since you made out a nice dinner the least i can do is have a um conversation and so he takes off his mask and you can see his uh face which is all messed up here and so we get some insight on deadpool here um he says so here you took me out for a nice dinner. The least I can do is float the conversation. You know the thoughts that keep you up at night. Why am I so screwed up? Does God hate me personally? Will I ever not feel like a walking, talking piece of crap? The old me would have would drown those thoughts out with various recreational poisons. But this last time, I couldn't shake it. Unfortunately, as I have a feeling, as you know intimately, guys like us can't just turn off our brains through the usual means. Everything grows back. It's a special kind of hell. One I deserve, but that doesn't mean I get... Um, but that doesn't mean a guy doesn't get tired. So we're getting some honesty here. And so Deadpool says one of those guys... Um, came and offered me 10 large just to, to chat. I obliged figuring there's more gold to grab. Enter Delta. Knows my story. Has my records. Claims he can fix me. I laugh in his face. Says that my life can't have meaning because the bad parts of me, the worst parts of me, are going to live forever. My healing factor distilled from your healing factor blessings and a curse kept me from dying of cancer but it also kept me from dying from cancer and he once again starts coughing again delta didn't bother trying to mess with the healing part lost cause he supercharged the cancer ten thousand times more uh virulent voila mortality the worst parts of me will die so that maybe the better parts will get gone i traded time for purpose and then i screwed it up and Wolverine says, you wanted me to stop you? And then there's silence. Wade, I'm not your friend. I'm not your freaking father. No, you're the one who figured this all out. Mutant Auscat suffers through the ass end of life. Um, gets turned into literal monsters and does unspeakable things for shady asshats. But even after that, you're, uh, you became more a man. And Wolverine's like, again, repeating that saying, third time's the charm. So Deadpool says, mercenary psychopaths 
with cancer turned beloved, ex adjacent anti hero icon turned an actual human being. And then, of course, off panel, the world will never know. And so Delta says it's time, you know, to move things along here. Another another double page uh, spread here. And so they're coming in with this uh, monster creature here. And Wolverine is like, fix him. And then Delta's like, I did. He squandered it. As per the contract, he will either l relinquish his biology t uh, to our work or be destroyed as he helped destroy the failures in Vancouver. And so... Um, and then he asks Wolverine if he's tired of pretending to be civilized all the time. And Wolverine says he's not taking the bait here. So he talks to Wolverine again, but you can see Wolverine here takes out his claws and is not interested. So, um, and then you see him snap his fingers here. And so the creature goes... And look at this. Just, um, I like this panel. I really like Adam Kubert. I'm just going to say it here. So um, he grabs Wolverine, throws Wolverine. Deadpool looks in shock. Wolverine, now you can see the creature here. Um, big, Bigger, faster, stronger. So while all that's happening, Delta is talking here. And he says, Mr. Wilson... Before you throw away what remains of your life, an alternative. Your becoming was stolen from you by your former self. I'd like to remedy that. I can reset the clock on the experiment of your life. Here you can see this creature just pounding on Wolverine um, as Deadpool watches on the other side here. Reset the cancer and give you another precious finite parcel of time. Send you back to civilization with a purpose. To answer the question that's plagued you since your first illicit thoughts. Am I truly a monster or can I yet be a man? Don't die a meaningless death for the entertainment of wealthy fools, Wade. Show them that you can become more and offers his hand out. And so, oopsie, Wolverine here, he's just pounded into, uh, that's just, um, and here's the creature who keeps repeating, I'm not afraid here, and Wolverine's like, erk, boo, and Deadpool comes right there from behind here, he is going to uh, save Wolverine as this creature is about to pounce, um, wonderful panel here. And I just hits Deadpool here. Um, poor Wolverine. He can just. <laughs> and uh, friggin' Deadpool, he says. And look at this. Just rips out his legs and um, bites his arm there. You can see it. And rips it off. Oh my goodness gracious. And Deadpool's like, just a flesh wound. And so. Um, there's Wolverine kind of, um, starting to get up here and screams and the creature just gets rid of both of them and just threw them out and look at the creature of not afraid. And so as they fall here and, uh, there's Wolverine and, <laughs> no head and suddenly uh there's the head that uh, he had thrown out look at this you can just see his cranium here guess we're putting that healing factor to a test he says here so and suddenly scrunch wade you are afraid he says and so thus ends the second issue we have one last issue to go it's only a three-part miniseries so and so here's the final issue here. Here's the regular cover. I, like I said, I love Adam Kubert. I think he is wonderful. You can see the dis uh, not disemboweled, the broken up Deadpool in the background there. So 
here's the backup or the one of the variant covers with a broken Wolverine here. And then I also bought this one for some reason. I don't know why I this this cover really kind of spoke to me. Um, so I also picked up the so I have the regular cover and this variant cover as well. And then this is uh, another variant cover. Um, <laughs> that's funny. And then we get another memoriam here for this uh, for this person that worked for the Marvel movies here. So. And so we start out with another double page spread here. Um, so again, could have been done in one here. Um, Deadpool versus uh, Wolverine essentially here uh, in this thing while while uh, this Delta guy speaks here. And Deadpool going back to breaking the third wall and being all, you know, the annoying part of Deadpool. But, you know, there is a charm. Like I said, I it, it, it's not my Deadpool's not my cup of tea, but he. You know, if he's your cup of tea, that is perfectly fine. Here are our credits. And so, Wolverine here fighting this creature it looks pretty badass to me. And uh, throws Wolverine just, goodness gracious. Um, told you all this is like an action movie. And here and that lady's mouth comes uh is uh showing up there here and so delta is uh speaking through her and delta as he speaks he says wade wilson hoped to emulate your path as a man who conquered his lower nature he died because his problem or sorry his premise was false you conquered nothing, nothing. Your nature is immutable. You're a monster. An animal who finds temporary uh, respite beneath a man's skin. I know it. Everyone watching knows. You deny it. You, your failed experiment of a friend couldn't see it here. And so all that as poor Wolverine's getting beaten up. Let me show you. And uh, look at that. Oh, just, oh my God, this thing is brutal. And so, and so this lady's like, glorious, but more than pay was pro promised. This had better work, Mr. Delta. We were denied one becoming. We will not be denied another, says the other person. And so... We got Wolverine here. Oh my God, he says everything hurts, and uh, look at him. Look at this. Um, I like Adam Kubert, as I mentioned. Um, great artist. And so we get this incredibly nice. Uh, it's this is an awesome uh, picture of Wolverine there with half his hand with half his skin gone here. Um. There he is. Isn't it a relief to drop the act? Meaning the monsters come back. So um, Wolverine's in that uh, famous berserker rage of his here. And so you can see Wolverine fighting that monster there. And the guy in the background just keeps saying, you know, nobody wants a civilized Wolverine. And then that monster's like asking for mercy. He's like, stop. I don't like this. And Wolverine's like, and he's like, help me. And Wolverine's just going to um, finish him off here. And so this guy's like, on my mark, Greta. And you see Wolverine running here. And uh, Miss, uh, Delta says, now. And he jumps through. And look at this. He's kind of like um, Deadpool is uh attached to him and we get this double page this is um pretty cool stop stop um for f's sake <laughs> and so 
That is nice. This is a nice double page spread. There's some double page spreads where I'm like, oh, that doesn't need to be, but then there are some really nice ones, and this one is nice. And so this one's also a double page spread here, but basically Wolverine's trying to get Deadpool off him, and Deadpool's actually trying to calm him down. Look at that. Takes off a rib and then shoves it in his ear here. So, And so here we are in a village here. And these people are watching, and Deadpool just calmed them down using the same thing. And Wolverine's like, oh my god, I almost killed them. Um, so, um, and now Wolverine goes, everything he said, uh, meaning Delta, is true. And the people are clapping there, and they're like, the healing factors are legendary, but this complete regeneration from blood... And they're like, um, Wilson's blood entered the Wolverine's body. I imagine the Berserker Rage helped accelerate. Who cares how it worked? Look at him. Them. How could we ever doubt our dear Delta? This. I want it. 100 millions. Will it stay like that? 500 million, the other person says here. So, um... You and what small nation? Oh, everybody's just... And Delta doesn't seem to be very happy with it. And so, um, and uh, Delta just says, this was a failure. And they're like, what? Um, so, um, this wasn't kind of what Delta was trying to do here. I don't like that name, Delta. Seems stupid, but it's all right. And so, um, you can see uh, Delta sending some of those... Uh, soldier things here and uh <laughs> Wolverine's still freaking Deadpool so um and th there we go it's a fight look at this and so I'm I left it like this just so you can see the big picture here so um as they uh decimate all these uh soldiers here and look at this. <laughs> so, um, and, uh, I think he's going to use that bone to cut the, cut himself off and separate from Wolverine here. Um, oh no, he's putting the, the rib back. Sorry. And, uh, with Deadpool's leg, I figured you'd want it back where I found it. So, and Deadpool goes, a job well done, I guess. Want to drown your innards in vodka while I, my bits grow back? And he says, make mine a bleach on the rocks. I'm going to smell you for weeks. For weeks. So we're kind of back at it. But um, they uh, throw the drinks here. Uh, a fitting end to your career, Delta. Um, so they're all turning on him. And Delta's like, uh, Greta, somewhere quiet, please. And so she teleports him. Um... And so he watches, and Greta asks, what now? Um, he says, change comes to all things. And so he's going to the next group of people here. So he left those, and uh, this is another place. Um, shall we begin our next phase? So a week later... They're there, and you can see Wolverine just and Deadpool here destroying everything here. Um, they didn't get Delta here because he left, but um, they so they got rid of um, those people, and they're bringing more people in. <laughs> and look at this, and so look at that. <laughs> I was having a bromant, so um, Wolverine says, you know what they say, and so um, fourth time is the charm, and so here we go, and so that really is the end of the issue, so after all that, like I said, it's an action movie, and but because it was a limited series, it's got a beginning, middle, and end, so uh, Wolverine and Deadpool basically went after um, everybody and made the price, but Delta is still at large, so he can be used again. So, anyway, um, 
Deadpool Wolverine 1 through 3. All of it combined. Um, hope, hope you enjoy it. Um, like and subscribe. I do thank you for listening. Goodbye.